It does not matter how much you have. It does not matter how poor you are. Once you have decided to get married to a woman, or once a woman decides to accept a man as a husband, they are into partnership. So as such, they should be able to have a discussion almost everything they are doing. A man does not have absolute decision-making right in any marriage, vis-a-vis -vis as well. So no man can stand up and say, oh, I am the man of the house, so I make the final decision. And no man can do that as well. In short, to be frank, household or the running of the family belong to women traditionally. They, are, they have control, they are the boss of the house. A man just needs to listen to the wife. If your wife said you won't eat honey, you won't eat. Your wife is like, is almost everything in the family. Without a wife, everything will just fall apart. That is why when you are filling an application, they always ask you what is your mother's tongue. They don't ask you what is your father's tongue. They know that male don't even run a family. They don't even know how to run a family traditionally. See, a woman is crucial in every marriage. So is a man. As such, it is a partnership. And I am not of the opinion that a woman should be primarily running the family, like preparing meals and all that. It is a partnership. If woman is tired, the man can do that. If man is tired, the wife can do that. It is a partnership. So ladies and gentlemen, this is just a brief discussion. What I want you guys to do is be a partner in your relationship, whether you are married or not. Whether you are living with your boyfriend or with your husband, just be a partner. Both of you, the man and the woman, have totally equal rights in that relationship or in that marriage. So. My final advice, be a partner and not a spouse. Relationship is all about equality. Marriage is all about equality. It's all about partnership, not dominance. A woman is not supposed to dominate and a man is not supposed to do that as well. Partnership is all about coming together, working together bringing your skills together and form a strong bond or in business term synergy by so doing you guys will have a successful marriage just like as in business world you don't expect one partner to carry out all the business transaction or business affair and you become a dormant partner there is nothing like dormant partnership in marriage both parties are always active. You guys make all the decisions together and carry out all the tasks together. Don't expect your wife to, to be the one doing all the house chores, to clean the house, to cook, to prepare the kids, to take them to school. No. If you, if you and your wife have made a decision for her to be a housewife, then there is no problem, but you don't need to force her to be a housewife. I believe in what we call feminine jurisprudence, whereby women do have equal rights as men in marriage. They have all the rights to do or to engage in any work they want to. I don't believe in managerial relationship whereby the man will command the woman on what to do and what not to do. Any relationship based on dominance does not last and there is no happiness and there is no love. So as such, when you are entering into any relationship, don't be a spouse, be a partner. Partnership lasts, spouse is shaky because spouse is full of dominance and control while partnership is based on mutual understanding trust and shared skill 
as such, to be a partner, not a spouse. Thank you and see you guys next time. And also, I would love you guys to subscribe to my channel. Find me also on Instagram and on Twitter as well. Let's join hands together and promote this topic together. Sign out and text.